Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today is going to be just a real quick video where I'm going to show you how to fix the issue with the whisker menu popping up every time you want to use the super key in a hotkey combination. So let's get right into it. All right, so here we are in XFCE, and I'm going to show you a little demo of this problem. So by default in XFCE, if you hit the super key or the Windows key, it opens up the menu, right? And that's that's cool. That's exactly what we want to happen. The problem is if you use that Windows key or that super key in combination with another key as a shortcut, that's when we start having problems. So say you're coming from Windows and you want to do the Windows E key to open up your file browsers. It works, but every time you hit that, it opens up the menu as well. As soon as you hit that Windows key, holding it down, and then you hit the E or whatever other key, it always opens that. Now, sometimes it conflicts so bad that the shortcut that you're setting up just doesn't even get recognized. So fortunately, there's an easy way to fix that, and I'm going to show you how to do that. Now, I'm doing this in Manjaro, but uh, this should work in whatever distribution you have. So I'm just going to go into search for a program to add here, and I'm going to add K super key. Now, this is a KDE application, but it actually... Uh, you can actually install it in other desktop environments. So I'm doing that in XFCE, XFCE here. <laughs> so let's type the password. It's going to go ahead and build it real quick. This just takes a second. And there we go. That's all set up. Now, right now it's not doing anything because that has to run for it to work. So I'm going to do a Alt F2 and do K super key, run that. So now it's running, and when we hit the Windows key, nothing really looks different. So this is where we, it gets a little tricky, because what K super key does is when you hit the super key by itself, it'll send the equivalent of Alt F1. So what we want to do is we want to change the shortcut to that menu drop down to Alt F1. And in Manjaro, uh, what we do is go into the keyboard shortcuts, application shortcut, and we can look for the whisker pop-up and we want to change the super L just double click on it and change it to alt F1 close now when we hit the super key the menu still opens but watch what happens when we hold down the super key and hit E now now we don't have that conflict anymore but if we hit the super key by itself it still opens the application menu and that's it super easy oh the next part uh, so in order for this to work, that K super key has to be running. So what we want to do is we want to add it to the startup sessions. And again, this may be a little bit different on your distribution, but in, you know, conceptually it's the same. So we're just going to go in here and you can call it, name it, whatever you want. But the command is K super key. So now every time we log into our session, that'll run and it'll let us have our separation between the menu and our shortcuts. All right, so that's the fix I found. If you have another fix, please leave it down in the comments. And I hope you found this useful and informative. If you did, please hit that thumbs up. And if you really liked it, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification to let you know when I put out a new video. Come see me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook as well. And uh, I will see you in the next video. Thanks so much for stopping by.